South's most accurate forecast. This is Good Day Memphis on CW30. All right, it's 7.43 for you here on a Monday. It's a soggy Monday here on Good Day. Yeah, what's us start. Case of the Monday is outside, yeah. and it's getting cold as the week yeah. unfolds, too. Uh, I don't know if we that much great news in terms of weather. Yeah. I mean, the one bit of good news is it's observed Veterans Day, so a lot of folks True. are either out of work, out of school, so you don't yeah. need to go outside today. But for those but that you do You want to go to that parade. Yeah, yeah. The parade, Chase. Yeah, brave the parade, brave work, whatever you're doing, just keep that umbrella handy because, as you can see on uh, radar, a lot of rain as we start off the morning. Some of the heavier rain right now across eastern Arkansas, northern Mississippi, but that is all moving northward very slowly, and everybody going to get a taste of this uh, probably now through lunchtime. But you can see some of those heavier showers uh, starting off Forest City, down into West Helena, across Mississippi. You're seeing it uh, Clarksdale, Batesville, over into Oxford, Oxford. And as far as the metro goes, that rain's still fairly light at the moment, but as we mentioned, that will be getting a little heavier over the next couple of hours. So if you do need to head out, just take it easy out there. Here's our, well, big picture set up here. We have a cold front that will be moving through later in the day, and you can see how cold it gets behind that. We're talking snow right now for portions of Oklahoma, Kansas, even Missouri. Thankfully, we don't have much of a winter weather threat, but those freezing temperatures certainly going to be there over the next several nights. Right now we're seeing temperatures low to mid 40s for many of us. 46 here in Memphis, 43 in Tunica, 44 Holly Springs. Planning out the rest of your day, you see not too much of a change here. We're going to be talking probably low to mid 40s for many of us through the course of the day. Uh, 46 around lunchtime. So uh, if you're going to be heading out, not just grab the uh, umbrella, but grab the uh, coat as well because it is going to be a bit on the chilly side. Here's what it looks like on the hour by hour. That cold front expected to move through probably around lunchtime, even early this afternoon. Uh, it won't do much for the rain at first. As you can see, 5 o'clock this evening, still looking at some widespread showers. So if you are heading to work today, Heading home, you'll want to take it easy on those roadways. Things still looking kind of wet. And then late tonight, as that colder air begins to fill in, you can see that chance for a little bit of a winter mix starting across northern Arkansas, trying to move into the uh, mid-south here, but thankfully not a lot of moisture on the back end of that front. So we're talking just a slight chance for a winter mix. And at that, uh, no accumulation expected, no major impact on the roadways expected. But tomorrow morning, you can see many of us right around that freezing mark as we start the day. And we're going to stay on the cold side, as I mentioned, through the next several days. Here's your seven-day outlook. Uh, 46 your high today with that rain, really through the daylight hours. 44 your high tomorrow. You're noticing temperatures at or below freezing, really through Thursday night. Uh, won't be until Friday where we start to see a little bit of a warm up there, but even then, that's about 10 degrees off where we should be for this time of year. Uh, we mentioned that chance for winter weather late tonight, late Wednesday as well, but both those times, like I said, very little impact on the road. So uh, as far as getting out and about, I don't think you're going to see too many issues there. Just a reminder for more on that forecast, make sure to find us on Twitter. You can find us there at Local Memphis.